All right, guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. Let me tell you, these people are crazy. They are crazy, and they think they could do whatever they want. And, in fact, they're supposed to work for us. They're supposed to be elected officials, and they're supposed to hold the Constitution of the United States. But, again, you know, they make decisions that we have to follow. And here is a video that I want to show you because the church has been attacked big time. And it's just sad to see this. You know, you see this COVID-19 have made a lot of churches stop. Churches are being doing what they can. They have applied all the CDC requirements. They have, you know, done a lot of live streaming. You know, and let me tell you, they're taking a hit. People don't have jobs. People can't donate to the church. Some of the churches can't even make it because they don't have the money that they used to to be able to do the things, right? But they have tried to follow all the guidance. You know, you got California doing silly things, right? Suing uh, churches or harassing churches, and they have to go through legal battles and all this stuff. But again, you know, you, you got to be really careful with this stuff because they're telling you, I'm about to show you a video. If you don't follow the rules, we're going to close you down. Wow. We are living in a country where now they're going to close us down. We can't even worship the Lord because they going to close our churches down. Let me come out to this thing first of all before I get into anything else. Let me do this real quick. Big shout out to everybody that is using my Prime uh, or my links down there in the description below. Today's Prime Day it was the 13th and the 14th. If you buy anything, we get a small little kickback. doesn't cost you any money, but it does bring money to the channel. And we definitely appreciate that because obviously... Uh, we got to sustain this some kind of way. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell. Make sure you share the videos, guys. Share the videos. Share them anywhere. Facebook, anywhere you can. I definitely appreciate that. All right, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let me bring the screen right here so here we have again you know new york what a surprise are you surprised are you california new york this place is out of control let me tell you there's a lot of new yorkers coming down here to florida you keep the silly stuff keep it in your state some people want to calm down here because all the stuff is silly and they can't take it no more we can't take the taxes but then they come down here and want to do the same silly stuff don't do it you're welcome to come. We hold you. But don't bring your silly stuff down here, right? Because these people are out of control. Let's watch this. You're dealing with government saying to religions, you shouldn't have uh, more than X people in your church or your mosque or your temple. That's a politically uncomfortable situation. You know, I have to say to the Orthodox community tomorrow, uh, if you're not willing to live with these uh, rules, then I'm going to close the synagogues. Mm, I'm going to do it. It reminds me of Fidel Castro. You know, Fidel Castro took over, and there was a lot of things that he did. I remember being a kid in Cuba. Religions wasn't that much out there. You know, like even the Catholic Church was there, but it wasn't, I mean, it was there, but you really didn't see that much, right? There were all the type of religions that, that it was common, but, you know, that's one of the things that he kind of took away, right? So, again, you know, he's going to do this. I'm going to tell the church, I'm going to have to close you down. It sounds to me like a dictator. It does sound to me like a dictator. It's, it, it's sad to see this, but we are living in a country, in a state right there, where you can't make your own decision. If you're a man, if you're a woman, and you go to a church, and you happen to see too many people, and it makes you uncomfortable, leave. Just leave. If you want to wear a mask, wear a mask. Watch your hands. Follow CDC requirements. If you think that, hey, you know what, it's just too many people here, you know you have the choice to leave. But now what we're seeing is a place where the American people cannot make their own decision. The government wants to do it for you. I close it down for you. You just do whatever we tell you to do, right? Insane. 
I have had a 30-year relationship with the Orthodox community. Oh, it goes back to my good father. for you. Uh, I have a very close personal relationship with them. This is the last thing mm -hmm. I want to do. Oh, of course it is. Forget the politics. I don't care about that anymore. Personally, I don't want to have this conversation. It's a difficult conversation. Poor you. Just poor you. You don't want to do it. You just don't. Oh, this is so uncomfortable. I don't want to do it, but I want to do it for the good of the people remember this you got to remember this remember this why do you need that ar-15 don't you want to protect the children you want to protect don't you care about the kids you should give away your guns don't you care about the children's safety don't let emotion take over and don't listen to emotions because emotions are just there in place to make you do things that are not necessarily the best thing right definitely not necessary the best thing and you're right on the line of government uh intrusion on religion mm. so it's hard i didn't want to close down 1000 bars oh, all yeah, right i had enough for him definitely enough for him uh it's insane anyways i make these videos for you guys to see what's going on let me know what you think put comments down below and as always, we got to send control.